Myron. I'm Vanessa. We are both from Property Advantage. To find out more about us, click on the link below. So today we are here to share about how we made 300000 on our first property and why we regret it. So our first property was actually an EC at Sengkang called Lush Acres. So at that point of time we were just together, we were excited to start a life together. Just like anyone, we went around Singapore to view several condos. We even applied for a BTO in Sengkang and we actually got a queue number. But end up we went for an EC. So that's how our journey began. So one day my cousin actually came to our house for a gathering and then he was very excited. So he told us that he actually bought an EC. So he told us that ECs are bought at a discount and there's government subsidy. And then after it privatized, after 10 years, we'll be able to make money from it. So we were very excited because uh, we like to make money. <laughs> so we actually went to view a few ECs and we fell in love with Lush Acres. So we went ahead with the purchase. We didn't know anything of property. We are just buying based on our feelings and emotions. That's all. When we bought the executive condominium, we didn't know that it's going to be a progressive payment. But after collecting keys, our money installment went up to about $2,800, which we didn't know when we bought the EC at first because we didn't do any calculation. We had to start paying our maintenance fee, which about $380 a month. So at that time, I was doing my own business and I didn't have a stable income. But we felt that it's a bit of a stretch for us. We even thought of like downgrading to a HDB so like the money is not going to be like 1000 plus, it's very affordable. But we didn't understand that we would eventually earn it back when we sell the property. So it was like a form of forced savings for us. We bought a 3 bedroom premium which adds up to about 1130 square feet for 921000 back in 2013. Eventually, we sold it for 1.22 million after 8 years at a profit of 300,000. At that time, I was already in the property industry and looking back at our decision to buy the EC, I actually regretted it. Why we regret it is because we wish that we bought private instead. We would have made at least 2-3 to three times because for EC, you have a 3-year building period and then you have a 5-year MOP. So you can only sell after 8 years to make 300000 But being a property agent, right, I saw many people who bought the right property make 300000 400000 in 3 to 5 years. So we actually could have made twice that amount in 8 years. But at the end of the day, I think we are still very um, happy that we bought. It's like a blessing in disguise. We have all been working so hard for the past 10 years. So we know how hard is it to save 300000 actually in our bank. We must really lead a very frugal life. Especially with uh, things getting more and more expensive through the years, mainly due to inflation as well. And the real blessing in disguise for us is that we actually managed to upgrade to a condo that is worth 2 million without touching our savings. In the next video, we will talk about how we bought our $2 million property without touching our savings. And also, we will talk about why we bought that particular development. Stay tuned. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to our channel. And also to give a thumbs up. Bye.